Hello, so in this video I want to show you some of the true functionality you can get with your mobile devices, in this case the Sony Ericsson Xperia Arc uh, device. Now I've got this connected up in such a way that it makes it a really powerful media computing resource that a lot of people don't realise the true functionality that you have with this device, whether it be in your home or your office. So what I'm just going to show you is what I've got here. So I've got my large HD display into which is connected an HDMI cable and that connects to the micro HDMI port on my Sony Ericsson. I then in turn have the Sony Ericsson connected to a Sony Ericsson Live Dock. And on the back of the live dock, I've got a cable which connects to the device itself. I've got the power input lead, and then I've got a full USB port into which I can connect anything I like. Now that is subject to support, but things like wireless keyboards, wired keyboards, mass storage devices, games controllers, all those sort of things are supported by the live dock and can be used with the Sony Ericsson smartphone. So I've got that mounted there, albeit not that neatly, but you could tidy that up. And now what I can show you is I've got my wireless mouse, I've got my wireless keyboard, and I can control my device using this. So I can go through my applications, I can go through my home screens by clicking and flicking through them. So I can click into my calendar. I see I've got an appointment there tomorrow to give blood. I can go back to my home screen. I can scroll down through my notifications, I can pick up my emails, I can write a new message using the wireless keyboard, so you can see that I've written that using the keyboard. I can attach things if I choose and then subject to how you've got your device set up and what content you have on it you can do even more things so I can go into my gallery so I can go into my pictures I can scroll through them I can play a video so let's take one here choose the application I want to play it with. So this is some footage from a Coldplay concert. And you may be able to see that it's also playing down on the arc there, so the HDMI is mirroring the image. I can go if I choose and play my music from my device and it'll then feed back through the HDMI and play through the speakers of your television. So I can control the music from here as well. Certain televisions you'll actually be able to use your remote control so here I've got Panasonic Remote Control and I'm now using that to control it. So you may be showing friends or family photos that you've taken from a recent outing. You can use it or control your device using remote control, wireless keyboard, or you could go to the device itself and con control it on the large screen. If you've got a setup in your home for things like wireless audio, you've got um, even more options. So for example, I've got a Sonos system set up here. So I can go into 
my Sonos application and I can then control my system. So for example, we can go in and play um, radio stations. So that's going to go off and set up to play the radio station. Oh no, such is the nature of legs. I'm now playing wirelessly audio through my speaker system here in the lounge. That's radio is picking up there. I can then go and do even more things through the Sonos itself. So it all depends on your setup, but there's true flexibility in what you do. You can use your applications. So I can go into Twitter here. I can write a new post if I want to using the wireless keyboard. So that just demonstrates some of the functionality that you've got here. There are so many. You could make a phone call. Uh, you need a Bluetooth headset really or you could shout across your, uh, across your room to your device to do uh, hands-free calling but I'd recommend a Bluetooth headset but there are so many options that you have and it's not always clear that these options are here on your mobile devices. You just need to understand them and how to um, best utilize them. So feel free to get in touch, post your questions, show video responses as to how you use your mobile devices in the home um, because we'd be really interested to hear. So we hope you found this useful and thanks for watching.